ഹലോ ഫ്രണ്ട്സ് വെൽക്കം ടു ഇ സി അക്കാഡമി ഇൻ ദിസ് ലെക്ചർ ലെറ്റ് എസ് അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡ് ടൈപ്പ് ആൻഡ് ഓർഡർ ഓഫ് ദി സിസ്റ്റം ബിഫോർ അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡിങ് ദി ടൈപ്പ് ആൻഡ് ഓർഡർ ഓഫ് ദി സിസ്റ്റം ഫസ്റ്റ് ലെറ്റ് എസ് അണ്ടർസ്റ്റാൻഡ് ദി ടൈപ്പ് ഓഫ് ട്രാൻസ്ഫർ ഫംഗ്ഷൻ ഇഫ് യു റൈറ്റ് ദി ട്രാൻസ്ഫർ ഫംഗ്ഷൻ ആസ് ജി ഓഫ് എസ് ഡിവൈഡ് ബൈ വൺ പ്ലസ് ജി ഓഫ് എസ് ഇൻ ടു ഹെച്ച് ഓഫ് എസ് ദിസ് ടൈപ്പ് ഓഫ് ട്രാൻസ്ഫർ ഫംഗ്ഷൻ വിൽ കോൾ ദിസ് ആസ് ക്ലോസ്ഡ് ലൂപ്പ് ട്രാൻസ്ഫർ ഫംഗ്ഷൻ and if we take the transfer function as g of s into h of s we'll call this as open loop transfer function so the transfer function which is represented as g of s divided by 1 plus g of s into h of s we'll call that as closed loop transfer function and the transfer function represented as g of s into h of s we'll call that as open loop transfer function now let us understand what is pole signed zeros let us take this expression as an example the number of roots in the numerator are known as zeros and the number of roots in the denominator are known as poles so in this example in the numerator we have s is equal to minus 2 as the root so we can say we have one zeros and denominator we have s is equal to 0 s is equal to minus 1 and s is equal to minus 4 as three roots so we can say we have three poles and the number of poles which is at s is equal to 0 are known as poles in the origin so we have s is equal to 0 as one pole which is at the origin so this is about pole signed as zeros now let us define the type of the system so we can define type of the system as the number of poles in the origin in an open loop transfer function of a unity feedback we know the open loop transfer function and unity feedback means h of s should be equal to 1 so the number of poles at origin will decide the type of the system if we have one pole at the origin we will call that as type 1 system if we don't have any pole at the origin we will call that as type 0 system generally we can write the expression g of s into h of s is equal to k into 1 plus t1 s into 1 plus t2 s divided by s to the power of j into 1 plus t a s into 1 plus t b s yes. in this equation k is resultant system gain and j represents the type of the system if we put j is equal to 0 in this equation we will get g of s into h of s is equal to k into 1 plus t1 s into 1 plus t2 s divided by 1 plus t a s into 1 plus t b s yes. so in this equation j is equal to 0 therefore type of the system is also equal to 0 so this type of system we will call that as type 0 system so in this expression if we put j is equal to 1 we will get g of s into h of s is equal to k into 1 plus t1 s into 1 plus t2 s divided by s into 1 plus t a s into 1 plus t b s yes. in this equation j is equal to 1 therefore the type of system is 1 so we can say this is the expression for type 1 system for type 2 system we will get the same expression with s square so if we have at the denominator s square such type of system we will call that as type 2 system where j value will be equal to 2 if we take an example to understand this 
let us take the expression 20 into 1 plus s divided by s square into 2 plus s into 4 plus s in this expression we can say j is equal to 2 j is equal to 2 therefore type of the system is also equal to 2 so this is the example for type 2 system now let us see what is order of the system order of the system is the highest power of s present in the characteristics equation of a system the highest power of s in the characteristics equation of the system is the order of the system now let us take an example where we will take g of s is equal to k divided by s into 1 plus t s and h of s is equal to 1 at that case we can write c of s divided by r of s is equal to g of s divided by 1 plus g of s into h of s let us substitute these two value here we will get k divided by s into 1 plus t s divided by 1 plus k divided by s into 1 plus t s into 1 now we can write this as k divided by s into 1 plus t s whole divided by s into 1 plus t s plus k divided by s into 1 plus t s so we can cancel out these two term so we will get c of s divided by r of s is equal to k divided by if we multiply s with t s it will be t s square plus s into 1 it is s plus k so the characteristics equation is t s square plus s plus k is equal to 0 if we take the denominator so in this characteristics equation the highest power of s is 2 so we can say the order of the system is 2 so the given equation is the second order system this is about the type and order of the system hope you have understood the topic thank you